right, guys, I hope you've enjoyed that quick clip from Monster Hunter Online showcasing the Devil Joe. He's almost upon us, so I want to show you guys everything there is to know about this awesome monster. Unless, well, they have added some stuff in Monster Hunter World. Now, we're going to cover the most basic things, and that is potions. Within these potions, you want to make sure you bring Mega Armor Skin. This is more important than even the Mega Demon Drug because the Devil Joe has this effect in his drool which causes defense down. This is why the Adamant Pill is equally as important. You can use this every time you get hit with that debuff. Now, this preparation is very, very needed seeing as he's a brand new monster and a lot of us have not faced him, so we don't know what we're getting ourselves into. And from what I've seen and all the research I've done, he's a pretty fierce beast. Barrel Bombs are very important because they'll play a big role in the way you fight the Devil Joe. If you bring Devil Blight, you'll be able to turn your regular Barrel Bombs into Mega Barrel Bombs in the middle of a fight. Now, Null Berries are pretty much essential when you fight the Devil Joe, seeing as he can inflict Dragon Blight, which takes away or reduces the elemental or status effect on your weapon. Keep that in mind. Now, the Devil Joe is very aggressive and he loves to eat in the middle of a battle, so make sure you bring meat. Here you can see the different kinds of meat there is in the game. The most popular being the drug meat, which actually puts the Devil Joe to sleep, allowing you to go ahead and do some sleep bombing, which as we know is one of the most popular tactics to deal damage to these troublesome beasts. Now, the last items are not really essential, but they do play a little role when it comes to battle time. Flash pods give you a little edge, and dunk pods in case any other monsters join the fight. This is very important seeing as we don't really know how the Devil Joe fully moves and acts, so we want to make sure that no other monsters get in the way. Our traps just help us deal a little more damage and control the situation, but apart from that, these are the main items you want to make sure you have when facing this awesome beast. Now let's get into how he actually moves, how he looks, and how he actually fights. Keep in mind there's no actual footage of the Devil Joe in Monster Hunter World, so this is from past games. There could still be changes to his patterns and how he fights, but this is as close as we're gonna get, so let's get right on to it. If you guys wanna know where these videos are coming from, I've given credit to the actual creators in the bottom right corner, so go out and check them out. Now if you see the Devil Joe, he's a very fierce opponent. You wanna be below his legs or right behind him. He has a lot of attacks that can deal tons of damage, guys. So you want to be careful with the way he fights and how he hits you. Make sure you do not get hit because simply getting bit by him might actually give you defense down debuff. After a certain amount of time, he will actually enrage, which is what you see right here. This is pretty much how he looks when he's enraged. And not only does he hit harder, but he gets a lot more aggressive, guys. Now, when we look into the Devil Joe, there are some attacks you really want to keep an eye out for. This is one of them, his Dragon Breath attack. Not only does it hit like a truck, but it, as I told you before, it can inflict Dragon Blight. As you can see, he will spam it when he's enraged, and if it hits, it will take a ton of your life off. Now, as I told you, we're going to need meat, and as you can see here, he's a big eater, and he's often prone to eat the meat you lay around, or if you've cut off his tail, he would eat his own tail. So, it always benefits you to bring meat, that way you can either paralyze him, put him to sleep, or add any other status effect that helps you out. Nonetheless, this was a quick video to give you guys a quick look at the Devil Joe and prepare you for this awesome beast that should be coming within the next couple of weeks. So if you've enjoyed the video, make sure to smash that like button and subscribe for now your boy Death Gun, out. <laughs>